everyone, it's Jamie Zebra 23. Um, I'm on all social media. It's Jamie Zebra 23. Uh, if you'd like a personal reading, you can check out the website, jamiezebra23.com. My readings are 20 minutes, 40 minutes, and 60 minutes. I typically do your readings within 24 to 48 hours. I also have a new feature, same-day readings. It's a little pricier, but you do get your readings the same day. I also have an $8 one question, one answer via email only. I typically answer you within about 20 minutes. So please be sure to write your email addresses correctly so that I can email you back fairly quickly. Also on the website, jamiezebra23.com, I've got full-size candles, do-it-yourself love kits, protection kits, prosperity kits. Crystal stones, pendants, Florida water, Florida water soap, incense sage, protection bracelets, pendulums for divination and prophecy. I also have a 10-minute tarot card reading for $25. It's not the reading special. This is something different. This is something that will be on the website every day from now on on jamiezebra23.com. Also, um, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. Keep in mind that the readings are general, so this is not, they are not personal readings, so they may or may not resonate. So please be sure to check out your sun, your moon, and your rising videos for further insight. Also, keep in mind... Um, that um, you must place an order before I can schedule you. So there's no need to email me and ask me what's on the website when you can simply go to the website and check yourself, right? So, um, and if you have any questions about the items on my website, you simply go to the description box of the item on the website and it tells you the times, the dates, um, when you should hear back from me, what the protocol is, all of that can simply be found by just going to the website and looking at the description. All right, guys, uh, please like, share, subscribe, and comment. Ta-ta for now. Hi, my Virgos. It's Jamie Zebra 23. I'm doing your week of February 3rd spread for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Cross Watchers. Um, keep in mind that these are general readings. They are not personal readings, so they may or may not resonate. Um, okay, first card out is you got the Knight of Pentacles. Okay. All right. And the Queen of Cups. Okay. All right. Whoa. Cards are flying. Okay, guys, keep in mind that these are general readings. They are, they are not personal readings, so they may or may not resonate. So please be sure to check out your sun, your moon, and your rising videos for further insight. Okay, this is for Virgo, sun, moon, rising, Venus, and cross watchers. What can they expect so far? So good, you guys. Very good. All right, I feel like some of you, there's a job offer coming in this week that's going to make you very, very happy. I also feel like for others of you, there's um, there's um you're going to be reaching out to somebody about love or somebody's going to be reaching out to you about love. Maybe your soulmate. If you and your soulmate took a break in the recent past, they will be back. I also feel like for some of you, there's a lot of happiness involved. I feel like for some of you, maybe you're even going to be getting married or you got a Taurus involved here. Um, yeah, somebody's, somebody's rekindling romance with someone. Yeah, somebody's been fantasizing. Whoa, that card just flew. Let me see what that is. Somebody's been fantasizing about you. Let me see what this is. The sun card in the reverse. It's the same meaning, but in lesser degrees. I feel like, um, I feel like for some of you Virgos, I feel like uh, somebody was standoffish. They didn't want to reach out to you because they were worried. They were worried that you wouldn't, that you wouldn't want to talk to them. You wouldn't want to deal with them. They were worried that you just weren't going to be the, the right fit for them. Um, or that you, that you just didn't want them anymore. Somebody was thinking, okay, they ghosted me or they stopped talking to me only for the simple fact of, you know, they found someone else. Some of you are wrong. I feel like this person never stopped. They, they always wanted you. They never stopped wanting you. But this week, finally, you guys are going to get a chance to really talk, talk, like say exactly what you guys mean, say exactly how you feel. Because this love, this love was instant. I feel like it was love at first sight and it's still love at first sight. I feel like this is a situation that can absolutely work. So if you guys were giving up on your love partners, if you guys were giving up on something, stop because it's, it's here. This is wish fulfillment. I feel like you guys are going to get everything that you want. This is also good health, attraction. Some of you thought somebody wasn't attracted to you. Somebody thought that you weren't smart enough, wealthy enough, that you didn't have anything to offer them. It's the, oppos it's the absolute opposite. I feel like you have everything to offer them, and whatever your situation is, they are fine with it. There's no issue with your situation. The issue was maybe with them. The issue was, oh, this person's too good to be true. They're too perfect, or I feel too much for them, or... Love at first sight isn't real. That's not practical. I'm a practical person. Whatever this is, Virgo, it's real. I also feel like for Virgo, um, you had a falling, I, I keep seeing like a falling out, but now you guys are back on. Or you will be. If this involves marriage, like if somebody's already married, but they think that you're their soulmate, they are getting a divorce. I think I got this for Capricorn and I think I got this for Taurus. I don't, I don't, 
I can't remember. I do so many readings, I don't remember. Um, yeah, somebody's ending something. Somebody, somebody's like, if, you, if you'll really be with me, I'll let go of everything. I'll let go of my whole entire life for you. If you're really, if you're really real about this, if you're really going to be with me, I will tell this person goodbye. I will go down and file divorce papers today. I feel like some, some of you, they already did file divorce papers. I feel like they were like, well, you know what? I'm never going to be happy again anyway. I might as well be divorced too. So I feel like somebody's already filed, but they're like letting you know, like it's now or never. Like, tell me what you really want. Tell me how you really feel, or I'm just going to proceed accordingly, whatever that means. If that means that I have to have like a life of just, you know, a buying escorts or a life of just loneliness, I will choose that because I know what I want and, you know, being next to somebody else in a loveless marriage is not, is not giving me what I need. I know what I need. Some of you, you only feel alive when you're around this person. You feel alive. You feel like yourself again when you're around this person and when you have that person in your life. I feel like it's a feeling you've never felt before. I feel like you guys were just fine on your own before you met this person, but they triggered something. This could be a soulmate. This could be a twin flame. Maybe this is your other half and you know it. They just bring out the best version of yourself. When you're not around them, you feel drained. When you're not around them, you don't feel alive anymore. You don't feel like yourself anymore. So I feel like for some of you, um, it's almost, I don't know why I just got a vision of this. I just got a vision of the tree of life. They are your tree of life. I've never associated the tree of life with love and romance before. But that's what they just showed me. They showed me the tree of life and they and it it, it felt like um, through the veins of the tree. And you guys are like, what? Veins of a tree? Trees don't have veins. I know. I got to tell you guys what I'm getting because it may mean something to some of you out there. It's like I when I'm with them, I feel like there's an IV from the tree of life to myself. Or an IV coming from the, the veins of the tree to both of us. We both have an IV in and it's coming from the tree of life. So I feel like for some of you, this person makes you feel alive and you also make them feel alive because it shows the IV going to both people. It's not just one person sucking the energy from another. You guys are giving it back and forth. You guys make life worth living. You guys feel untouchable together. There's a strength with the two of you together that you've never had with anybody and you didn't even know that any was, anything was missing until you met this person. So it's inevitable that there will be a reconciliation. It's inevitable that you guys will find your way back to each other. You just have to be open and honest with each other about this. It, for, you know, I feel like for somebody, for one of the parties involved here, you guys don't know. Like you don't know how to word these things because they, maybe they don't believe in this stuff or they don't even know about this stuff. It's real. It's here. It's now. But I feel like you guys are just, they're confused. You're confused. This could even be like a same-sex situation. Um or not but yeah somebody knows somebody feels somebody feels like you feel so if you're thinking they don't feel it they don't know they know they feel it but they don't know how to say it they don't know how to express it they're trying to make sense of it all so if they're not as, as spiritually evolved as you are they don't know all right my virgos have an amazing week jamiezebra23.com please like share subscribe and comment ta-ta for now